an active weather pattern continues to be the trend as we move through our new work week. So saw some pop-up showers and even a few storms yesterday. Still holding on to some of that as we start the morning. Uh, the good news is we are free of the storms, but still likely we'll continue to see showers just wrapping back around this low pressure, moving in all throughout the day today. So as you step out the door, not a bad idea to have that jacket and umbrella since pop-up showers will just kind of pop up wherever they want and likely will only last five to 10 minutes before back to cloudy skies throughout the afternoon. Good news is though, high pressure is currently building across parts of the northern Midwest that likely will start to move in throughout the day today. So tomorrow still likely will be stuck with some clouds, but we really see improving conditions, especially for the middle and towards the end of the week. So not so great today, but great pool weather, especially Wednesday and Thursday, as we should see plenty of sunshine. I'm only giving Friday a fair day because while temperatures will be warm, humidity will be up as well. So it will be great feeling pool weather, the high humidity and warm temperatures. Good chance we could see a few showers, maybe a storm or two trying to pop during the afternoon. But even if that does, still a great opportunity to get to the pool. Just make sure you do have that Storm Tracker 7 weather app downloaded to see radar up through updates all throughout the day for your Friday. Those we start the morning, still seeing some light showers coming on down across the Fort Henry Bridge, but notice those dew points still. Still in the 60s with our temperatures in the 60s as well. So noticing things, even though a little bit cooler than yesterday, still noticing things a bit sticky and uncomfortable. That's just likely going to continue to lead to those pop-up showers all throughout the day today. So most of the rain though has tried to move on through. Still likely we'll see just a few light showers this morning, but by the time we get to the afternoon, the coverage itself of those pop-up showers starts to increase with the intensity itself really not starting to increase until we get to, I would say, just about dinner time. So 5 p.m. we see the activity becoming more isolated to spotty, but notice how we do see a few more heavy positives. So stray, heavy or moderate shower is possible, but I don't expect to hear any rumbles of thunder like what we did for our day yesterday. But by the time we step out the door tomorrow morning, showers out of the area and we will start to clear up. So expect clearing skies, but warming temperatures throughout the day tomorrow. Today though, really won't see our temperatures change a whole lot, only getting into the low 70s, but we're really gonna notice things starting to warm up over the next couple of days. So still below average today and tomorrow, but notice especially the end of the week through the weekend. Good chance we'll see temperatures getting into the upper 80s with high humidity, and unfortunately that likely will stay the trend over the next two weeks. So as we start July, Climate Prediction Center does expect us to see above average temperatures. So expect this very warm and sticky weather, unfortunately likely will stay with us for the next couple of weeks. Clearing skies and warming temperatures for our day tomorrow, then beautiful weather as we head towards the end of the week. Mostly Sunday, 84 for our day on Thursday. Some sunshine for the first half of our feel good Friday. Though I can't rule out a stray pop-up shower or storm, but much of that rain though really likely comes Friday on Saturday and Sunday before we're back to sunshine in the mid-80s Friday on Monday.